hey guys welcome back to my channel so this one is going to be a paris vlog i am going to paris so as you guys know i live in germany but i don't live too far from paris it's like a four hour ride and my best friend actually live in paris so i'm excited i'm going to see her now let me show you guys my outfit okay let me show you guys this fit it is so dark you guys but anyways we move so i am wearing this top from mango these trousers are also from mango actually let me turn the camera upside down so i am wearing this whole mango fit this shoes are from hermes these are the orange sandals from hermes and yeah i think it's a cute outfit or whatever i love mango you guys okay let me tell you something about me I adore mango because there are who okay we don't know her <laughs> anyways you guys I'm all packed out okay I got my bag with me this bag is from YSL obviously as you can see and let me tell you something baby okay this bag was well worth the investment okay you can fit your life in this bag okay okay maybe not your life but you can definitely fit your diet in it it is packed it is full as you can see because i got so much stuff in here because like i'm only going to be taking this bag with me here this is a longchamp travel bag and that's all right i have everything that i need in here because i'm only going to be staying for the weekend so i'm all ready to go you guys i'm just waiting for my uber i'm sweating you guys because it is so hot here in germany it's like 40 degrees and i think it's even hotter like in paris it's like 42 degrees which is like 80 or 84 fahrenheit like so i got the sunnies here these sunnies are from gucci yeah and i'm all ready to go when the uber gets here we're gonna go to a train station i will catch up with you guys in the train station i will try okay i'm so nervous about vlogging in public but i will try to get at least at least the train shop okay you guys <laughs> see you at the train station welcome back to my channel so this is day two and i just got ready and you know i'm wearing this very very minimal makeup because this hit is serious okay so what i want to do now is get some paul and if you guys do not know what paul is then we simply cannot be friends <laughs> i don't get what anyone says no i'm just joking you guys i mean you know if you don't like paul we cannot be friends if you don't know what paul is then that's fine paul is like a bakery a chain here in france but you know you also have it in belgium i also been to a paul in dubai so i know that you know uh there are many of those in mainly french-speaking countries but i guess you can find them otherwise i um, elsewhere i mean i don't think that there is any poor in america but if there is you guys let me know in the comment section down below and basically it has this super buttery croissant like you can taste the butter you guys like my mouth is muttering uh, my mouth is muttering <laughs> my mouth is watering only thinking about it so i am very very excited now i do not usually eat croissant and stuff like that because you know i try to eat a very clean diet but you know when in paris i do indulge because in germany we do not i mean the nerves of german people calling uh croissants like buddha croissant which means like literally means butter croissant when there is no butter like i never eat croissant in germany i'm like sir where's the butter okay like <laughs> stop playing with me <laughs> anyways you guys i'm just gonna go and grab some paul and then i will come back and show you a tour of this airbnb which is quite simple and then i'm going to link up with my best friend and we have some dinner plans which you know but i will tell you guys about those later because your girl is Hungry? Okay, catch up with you guys later. You guys, I finally got my fall. Okay, I'm so excited. I'm so happy. Anyways, does any of you guys know how to eat a croissant without like having crumbs everywhere? Like, please leave some tips because like, 
I'm so embarrassed to eat croissants like publicly because I always leave crumbs like everywhere. So guys, I'm going to show you a quick tour of this Airbnb. So here's the entrance and then you get into the bathroom. Now, here am I. Okay, you guys, this is my outfit. This is what I'm wearing today. I'm wearing this all orange outfit, I guess, from Mango. The And then this orange sandals from Hermes. Now, I know that it is many of the girls aesthetic, okay not to wear any color but you know i happen to believe that black women look amazing in orange and yellow and yeah that's what i'm gonna do okay again this whole fit is from mango because there are who we don't know her okay and then you have like the bathtub and then a quick like toilet and you know like washing machine or whatever and then you get into this main thing here i guess you have like the kitchen real quick and then this table here you have like a TV and stuff obviously you have a bed and then like this outside the view or whatever hey guys I'm back and to be honest I've been doing a terrible job I show you guys around you guys know this is my very first vlog so please bear with me but I will try my very best to do better tomorrow and after tomorrow but for now we have dinner plans, Bessie and I, we are going to dine in one of Paris, like finest restaurant, which is Cesar Curry. Uh Lately, Cardi B and Rihanna have had dinner there, so I'm really, really excited. I've never been there, Bessie been there, but I've never been there. But I am trying to keep my expectation low because, you know, this is type of like a see and be seen place. So I don't know how good the food is going to be. And, you know, when your expectations are high, you tend to be disappointed. But anyways, uh, dinner of it is this gorgeous mango seed dress and you guys i swear like 70 percent of my clothes out is from mango and the reason for that being is that even though i like zara like i feel like when you wear zara there is a very high chance that you are going to bump into someone that wear the same outfit you know with all the zara haul i mean there are also some mango holes but you know like when i was 19 this <laughs> happened to me once and i vowed that it would never happen to me ever again so you know, I do still buy some Zara stuff, but when I do, you know, what I tend to do is like keep them for a year or a year and a half and then stop wearing them then. So if you're looking for a tip, if you're also like me and you know, kind of OCD about <laughs> having someone wearing the same outfit than you, you can do that. I'm going to be taking this Louis Vuitton bag with me and this Fendi sandals and you know, I think I look kind of cute or whatever. I will uh, show you guys the food at the restaurant and also I will try to OOTD bestie and I promise tomorrow I'm gonna try very hard. It's so hard to vlog like in public because I feel like everyone is staring at me but tomorrow I promise to try very hard to do that. Okay you guys, I'll catch up with you when I come back from dinner. I'm with Agnes here and we're doing a quick old CD. So Agnes, tell the guys where your outfit is from. Okay, uh, from the toes. I have no idea, but we're really cheap. Okay. And then this is from a shop from Norway. <laughs> <laughs> we love cheap, cute stuff. Go ahead and with your bad self. From, I have no idea from where. They're really and cute. It's, um, ICL bag. Yes, girl. So this is the OTD from Agnes tonight. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, show us that nice legs, girl. Don't tell me I'm gonna die in Paris for this vlog. Y'all better like. <laughs>
hey guys welcome back to my channel so this is paris day three i guess and yeah i'm just wearing this cute dress from you guessed it right mango and this sandals that i already wore like the other day yesterday oh uh, these are the orange sandals from uh hermes and yeah actually let me talk to you guys from here the light is better so how was Caesar Paris well it wasn't so good I mean I guess the appetizer was really really good and Agnes also really really enjoyed her dessert but like I told you before we went this is more of a seen and be seen place you know if you just you know want a cute Instagram aesthetic and you know being able to say that you went to the same restaurant than Steve and Marjorie Harvey Rihanna and you know I don't know who then I guess that's okay you know Neymar my pay and stuff but you know the food wasn't that great you know this channel is about keeping it real so save your money <laughs> actually I even found the Phuket to be better if you don't know what Phuket is it's also like a really fancy uh, restaurant in Paris so today we are going to go to the Versailles Palace and I'm going to show you guys around shout out to my friend Agnes who helped me yesterday get some you know of the footage that I guess you just seen uh, before this clip and yeah i'm going to be alone but i'm going to try my very best to <laughs> show you guys the scenery and stuff we may also grab you know some coffee some breakfast uh something like that and you guys i need to tell you i guess this is going to be a mini story time or whatever um about this uber driver yesterday this was crazy so yesterday we went to cesar paris and after this we went to you know we walked to the trocadero road to the eiffel tower i'm sure you've seen you know the picture already on the thumbnail and you know we got some really good pics you guys again shout out to my friend agnes and yeah so after this we went to a bar and then we decided you know to come back home to the airbnb so i was trying to get an uber and you know you guys this uber accepted the uh, the fare like the ride and then he didn't want to come like he was three minutes away and what he did uh was drive like 11 minutes away now the next uber after him that we took to uh come home actually told me that the reason why he did that is because when you cancel like um 10 minutes or more than 10 minutes like if the car is 10 minutes or more than 10 minutes away then there are no cancellation fee and i wish you know he just wrote me and told me you know now you can cancel for free or whatever bear in mind before this i tried writing him i tried calling him and he just wouldn't mind me he wouldn't answer and like for 15 minutes he was just driving around and around like hoping that i would cancel which is so mean you guys i found that to be very very mean this is very mean spirited and this type of stuff only happened to me like in paris i never have this problem like where i live but in paris this uber's driver tend to be like crazy and that was really like oh it was so annoying and you know my phone was also dying i didn't have any battery and if he like you know if my phone had went off and then we would have needed to take a taxi and go and you know redraw some money really crazy stuff like uber drivers in paris are not well anyways you guys that's it for this mini story time i swear most of this vlog i'm just sitting out here and you know <laughs> talking to y'all but that's fine i hope you guys don't mind anyways you guys i will catch up with you you know at the uh, versailles palace okay anyways you guys we have made it to the versailles palace as you can see i wonder if that is gold anyways it's really nice as you guys can see i don't know if i will be going inside actually i do think that you need um a ticket or stuff to go inside and i'm alone and i don't really want to like i want to go back to my friend's house and eat something so i'm not sure i actually want to do that but it is nice and um yeah i can i guess walk around in the other direction and try to show you more scenery i guess like from around this area or whatever I've never been here before you guys and I've been like to Paris a gazillion and when I tell you a gazillion like 39 times you know and I guess this is where you get a ticket I think it's 30 or 40 bucks but anyways anyways you guys this says King Quarters actually it says King's Horse Quarters which I think is guess I guess is where the king used to keep his horses back in the days back at the time again i would really like to know if this is gold i think i'm gonna google it and then i'll write it on the vlogs and let you know um yeah i do speak french to you guys i am fluent in french even though nowhere in this vlog do you hear me speak french to anyone because 
I am terrible at this vlogging thing and I'm shy, okay? <laughs> Let me show you around, like, around this place some more. As you all can see, we came really close to the water. I'm like really close to it. And this is gorgeous, you guys. As you can see, this is like a huge spot. Like, really amazing nature. As you guys can see, I really, really dig this. Like really, 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 really pretty. Very, very gorgeous. Hey guys, welcome to Paris Day 3. So today I am wearing this dress from Kukai. Actually, my mom got me this dress. So shout out to my mom, okay? <laughs> And yeah, actually there's a lot of boobade situation going on with this dress, but it is kind of long So I guess that kind of like forgives it if you <laughs> get what I mean and then with the dress I'm wearing this Birkenstocks because you guys like there's just going to be a lot of walking involved and you know I'm not interested in suffering <laughs> in hips or whatever today we are going to go to the Louvre Museum and I'm excited you guys because I've been to Paris like 29 times and I've never been there <laughs> but this time around I really wanted to go there and you know show you guys around and you know Bessie and I we're gonna have some lunch um, at Fouquet's I guess or you know somewhere around there and yeah I also want to show you guys this super cute um necklace it is from Bulgari it is rose gold and I think it is genuinely gorgeous Okay, you guys, see you then then. Hey guys, so we finally made it at the actual Louvre and I just want to say thank you to this vlog because like I said, if it wasn't for y'all, I would never be here. <laughs> Seriously, but there's a lot of people as you can see the line is very long so we are not finally go in but I'll show you guys you know the cute pyramids that you always see on insta or whatever let's try and get a picture there <laughs> oh. what that is for the jardin yeah it's really nice mm -hmm. I like it it kind of looks a little bit like the west side yeah, I think it's because it's in the same... Uh... Yeah, it's kind of like how they build there, mm -hmm. but no, you know, Versailles has like more of this gold tone situation going on. Patsy. That's also gold. That thing. Yeah. And the top of the obelisk, it's also gold. Mm -hmm. Oh, the pyramids, finally! I always wanted to see them, you know, but laziness won't let me be great. Yeah, you see, finally now. <laughs> Now we finally made I think that something is going uh, inside of these things. Yeah, I think that we can't go we can't go there. I think it's some um, very important shit. Yeah, so this is the closest we'll get you guys. Apparently we can't make it in there and take you know the picture. Do it for the gram. Go. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Yeah.